Instead of just putting it on the shelf, we take that and make it into a solution and utilize as much as he has or trade it in to get the value back out of it instead of just selling him a, a one a one road path. We give him three or four different scenarios to look at a five year plan and a ten year plan. Um, as you guys met Pete Youngblood earlier, he's our Eastern Iowa guy and uh, I mean he's he comes from an ag leader background so we try to get guys that specialize in one area, but are versed in all. So then, if, if we have a problem in one, he can call one of one of our other guys and just kind of throw the ball back and forth till we get the solutions made and see what's going to be the best scenario for him. Uh, right now, we're covering our furthest customers northeast or all the way north of Madison, Wisconsin. Southeast, we are down to. Uh, Springfield, Illinois. Um, we have some stuff down in the Missouri border. Nebraska, we get over by the Lincoln area. We're about halfway through South Dakota and our new territory is taking, them, taking us up to Minneapolis. So we're looking to add at least probably another two or three guys throughout the next couple of years as we find them. It just takes a good six to nine months to find that right position. It lives in the right territory so they can cover it effectively. But uh, that's pretty much what we're going for at this department and how we can build it for it. The first thing is their, their people skills. One, what they've done. Uh, I mean, it would be nice to hire a guy right out of college. But you, you can't read a book or you can't get the hands-on experience until you've done it for a couple of years. I mean, our, our newest guy, is, he worked with me for a year and then went out and did it for another company for two or three years. And he's finally fit the position of being able to run a territory, know the product, give accurate quotes, and give a full solution. Um, our, our next phase after we get the, the key people put into the territory will be bringing in interns. And if, if we like what they're doing and how they're going with it, pretty much we'll take it and uh, we can have Pete take a guy under his wing and get the territory to work with new leads and people overlook how he does his roles. Um, I mean, that's, that's something that you just have to have that mentor to look at what you're doing and how you're doing it and go from the bottom and then step your way all the way up. But the, the biggest thing is just finding those the right group of kids or guys that have people skills and can, can mix and match multiple different scenarios and just throw prices that are accurate in their head back and forth. I mean, once you do that, then it's the service side, accurate service. It's... Like you said, it, it took me six to nine months to find Pete, and now it's finding these next guys and getting that next guy ready by uh, by the farm show season here this 